da 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 If you're into mystery or thriller detective type stories, you might be in the mood for this, even if the film sounds, a, or not film, the video game title sounds a bit drastic in terms of its plot. But again, this is sort of like a, a winter set uh, abandoned hotel mystery with family aspects. It seems of a, a, the principal lead character coming in having to investigate this mystery or perhaps the seeming suicide that might not be. Right? It's a bit of a mystery. The trailer certainly has given us enough ambiguity or ambiguity in that. And I do think, you know, presentation-wise, it looks fun. I mean, I haven't checked out uh, uh, Di Didalic Studios as much. And they're a name I've heard. I have them on my list in terms of more projects to look at. This is more so just a first impression. I'm kind of fascinated by their work. I mean, again, it's very much in line of what you expect from a, a detective mystery. But you're going about the experience yourself, right, through the gaming platform in a very, I think, well-illustrated environment. Let's see what this more recent trailer has to offer. I think the first trailer gave a good scope. It had some interesting techniques, even with, like, I, I, I thought the map interface, which is typical for, you know, many different games with a wide canvas, uh, especially for a mystery, you know, that's fitting to trace your steps. It looks like it's got the measures of a good mystery, or at least one that would be standard and easy to follow. We're going to go ahead and watch this first, or standard in the format, I should specify. Not to say, like, it's a standard mystery, like, it's less in quality. I don't know. Again, I've witnessed the story yet other than the trailer. We're going to go ahead and watch the Out Now trailer first, and we'll talk about it more in my condensed review segment while watching the video together. Okay. Let's see if there's changing anything, if there's any upgrades. Let's take a look. If there's anything else to talk about. Again, I like to give the full scope possible whenever I can. It's a beautiful logo, by the way. It fits very well into the classiness of this trailer. We will definitely check out more work from them going forward. Okay. Very interesting. So again, there's there's a lot of depth in the story. Maybe even more issues than they've uh, stated in the synopsis. I like the promise that I won't be pulled away. Right from the beginning stages. Again, it's a drastic title. I mean, again, if the events... Uh, the way I'm seeing it from the synopsis... And, and you, of course, you, know, you read that and you're like, oh, that sounds like a really sad detective story with, with uh, horrible situations that have happened for this uh, young woman, I guess, who's been distant from... Obviously, this location, I think she's had for about like 10 years in the first trailer. But when you put it in the context of mystery, especially with what we see in the trailer, I'm like, is it true? Is it not? That is the mystery, as it's being illustrated, that we have to solve, in particular, uh, for the gameplay. And I think and it looks beautiful. I love winter set games. I mean, beautiful even with, again, the drastic circumstances. But it certainly promises a lot. Like, it, 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 let's look at the reviews here. Um, it's certainly up there with the best in this genre. Okay, that's promising. That's from Cultured Vultures. Not that I give gaming journalists the most credibility, because I think they've kind of shown that, like movie critics, they're not really the most informed on what the audience really cares about. But, okay. They're giving praiseworthy notice here, so I'm anticipating that th this does reflect. I I'm going to hope it does, because I can see that in the trailer. It manages to treat extremely delicate issues with extraordinary tact. Obviously, I'm assuming that's not just talking about the suicide. There's probably more issues going on from there. Maybe more family baggage, essentially, with this young woman. Or, uh, well, young woman, yeah, I think it's what's specified in the trailer. But she, uh, maybe just, the, 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 uh, the main protagonist. She's having to investigate these issues on her own, I guess, and, and to go through those ghosts in her past as it references through the hotel. So maybe there's more going on than just, you know, the tragic death. In this case, I think it was the mom. I don't remember exactly. A masterpiece in atmospheric storytelling. It'll keep you glued to your screen. I love that promise. It's a thriller. It's a, it's a detective mystery thriller with a lot of different locations. And it should be a fun mystery to investigate. I mean, again, a tragic, a dark one, but fun in the gameplay. We'll see how it, 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 how it goes. But, you know, I think with those promises, I think there's potential. And I will definitely check out more from Didalic uh, Entertainment in the future. I think, was it Didalic Entertainment? Is that their name? Yes. We'll check out more of their stuff in the future. What are you guys' thoughts with the suicide of Rachel Foster? Let me know down below. Don't forget all the good stuff. Like, subscribe to the sharing that bell. Until we get to watch more from the studio, I will see you guys at a point that was me. For now, thanks for watching this video. I love you guys. Don't forget to love your fellow man. God bless and peace.